AITA for saying, that sounds like a you problem, to my, 24F, ex-husband, 34 meters, GF, 25F. Today my ex-husband called me saying I'm a vile human and am an AH. This situation is quite complicated. I have a three-year-old son with my ex-husband. But he hasn't been involved in our lives since October 2021. As a single mom who is also attending school, I took him to court. And he now pays child support as ordered by the court. Recently, my ex-husband's girlfriend reached out to me on Facebook. She asked me to stop making my ex-husband pay child support because they just had a new baby and are struggling to afford formula. In response, I empathized with their situation but explained that the child support is a legal obligation my ex-husband willingly agreed to when he brought our child into this world. Ultimately, their financial difficulties are a you problem. I understand that my response may have come across as harsh. And I feel a sense of guilt for expressing it that way. However, it's important to acknowledge that my ex-husband made the decision to have another child. And it is not my responsibility to intervene in his relationship or financial matters. Each individual is accountable for their own choices and the consequences that come with them. M. T. D. R. I told my ex-husband's GF that it's her problem they can't afford to feed their own kid. My ex-husband says I'm an AH for making him pay child support. So, AITA? Edit. I am fortunate to reside in Canada, where I am currently pursuing my education to become an early childhood educator. ECE. The demand for ECE professionals is high in our country. And I am grateful that the Ontario government fully covers the expenses of my program. Additionally, I receive a generous monthly allowance of $500 after paying rent. I am able to manage my finances effectively and live comfortably on an annual income of $13,740. In contrast, my ex-husband enjoys a substantial income of $70,000 and lives with his mom not paying rent nta she should have not approached you but addressed her request in court if his financial situation is so shaky he can get the child support to be revised by a judge oh wow a two-parent household wants you a single mother to help subsidize their family i'm surprised you didn't laugh in their face nta NTA. The ex-husband was already in awe for not being involved in his child's life. But the girlfriend became one when she called OP to ask to stop child support payments. If I was OP I would have asked the girlfriend hypothetically if I stopped the payments would my ex become hands-on with his son or will he keep not being in my child's life all the while being there for his new child's life physically, financially, and emotionally. NTA but next time. Point out that they have two adults and are struggling. You are a single parent to a young child. How could she expect that you don't need child support on your own if? Again, there are two of them and only one of you. Ha 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 ha. He must be joking. Incredible cheek from both him and her. If he can't support two children, he needed to not go and have the second one. Sorry if that sounds harsh. But his fecklessness should not be your problem to solve. NTA. Ultimately it is a them problem, not yours. Your ex-husband chose to not help you raise your child and he legally now has to pay for that. While it's unfortunate that they can't afford formula it really is not your problem. In ta. You aren't making him do anything. The court is making him be held responsible, even if just financially, for a human being he created. NTA. She had a kid with a dude that ditched his kid. That's definitely her problem. NTA. If your ex could not afford to pay child support and have a baby, 
Maybe he should have thought of that before having the second child. He decided to have two children he needs to grow up and understand that he has a responsibility to support both of them. And it is not fair to you to make your life harder because he made a bad decision. Also, he is not giving you the child support the child support belongs to your kid. You are simply managing it for them as their guardian. NTA looks like your ex is a serial predator going after ladies 9 years younger than him repeatedly. NTA. Everything you said is correct. He should have thought first before impregnating another person. NTA. What's he planning to tell this woman, when his next girlfriend has a baby, too? OFC NTA. He has an obligation to his first child, period. The least he can do is send money. NTA they need to attempt to get government aid, food stamps if things are this dire. NTA. Child support is his obligation to his child. He needs to follow the court order. Not your issue. Strong NTA. Real gall to even ask this of you oh. So your kid should struggle because one man couldn't stop himself from having a baby he couldn't. Afford? If he wants to stop paying child support. Good luck to him in the legal system. Anything else is a lame excuse to manipulate you. On a side note. Man. Unless your ex manipulated her. This woman had a baby with a broke deadbeat. Good choices all around. I used to work for support enforcement. I can't tell you how many people wanted their child support because they had a new family. Gee, did they forget they already had children to support before they had more? Did they think this was like getting a new car? And didn't want to pay for the old one? It made me so angry. NTA but this guy is a walking red flag. He sure likes him young. Tell her she too can collect child support when he knocks up another woman 10 years younger than he is. My then stepmother made a similar request toward my mom after my brother was born. Because, we have a new baby, to which my mom told her. Too bad. He has old responsibilities. A little more bitching from steppy and mom advised her to get a job. NTA. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.